As I've traveled around the world, I have met some incredible people, all unique, and each one I've found has a story. We all have stories. And I've also found that every time we have dark moments in our lives, no matter what they may be, we'll always find a hope revealed. Hey, Russ Johns here, and I'm on Hope Revealed today with Matt Crump. And I love the content creation, the creativity, and the faith and hope that he drives and shares with the world. I uh, love creating content. You can find me on LinkedIn, YouTube, Facebook, and at RussJohns.com. Connect with me. I'd love to build a relationship with you and share some smiles are free. Kindness is cool. And we can make it matter. So I want you to enjoy the day. I'm at the point in my life where I want to be able to share some of these things because I see a lot of people struggling, a lot of overwhelm. And one of the things that I wanted to do is highlight some of the people, interesting people doing interesting things on LinkedIn. And I thought the whole idea of pirate broadcast was, you know, back in the day of AM radio, there were, you know, ships offshore that were broadcasting illegally. Well, they weren't illegal because they weren't on FCC territory. <laughs> it, was a, it was like, okay, we can do what we want because we don't need to ask permission. And I didn't have LinkedIn Live access at the point at that point in time, so I went to YouTube and was streaming live, and then I would, I would bring that into LinkedIn as if it were a LinkedIn Live, and I would call it pirate broadcast because it's like, hey, I, I can do this because I know how to do this, and I'm going right. to do this. <laughs> Posters. Were you the guy that climbed up like a thousand feet and stuck the stuff to the thing? Yes, yes. You're, you're crazy, dude. I mean, they're I, absolutely. I would never. I couldn't imagine that. What about those ones that are way up there? Did you go there too? Yes, absolutely. absolutely. How did you do that and stick the stuff up there and not be like, "Hey, Fred, hang on." Whoa! <laughs> In the early days, it's like fall protection was not necessarily the first thing that you thought about. And uh, that's what I tell people. I'm I telling thought. you, Russ, if I'm a thousand feet in the air, the first thing I'm thinking <laughs> You're about wear something, is huh? falling. <laughs>